da ist eine ganze Flut. Ja, ich arbeite dran. That intro clip was absolutely insane. Conric with a 2,800 point streak. On Dammit Van Peak, those enemies bunching up just outside the tunnel in the perfect position. It's always great when that happens. Moving on to something a little more aggressive with the L96, its archer, and an aggressive sniper streak. Archer did send two clips in, this one is going to be on Operation Metro as if it needs an introduction, the M416 is his weapon of choice, taking out a couple of stragglers before making his way up the escalator into the enemy nest. A big point stack and an awesome kill streak. Get Two Tapped is coming in with a Grand Bazaar run and gun special with the shotgun, getting involved with the Spaz 12 as he runs down the street here. He knows exactly where the enemies are. A bit unfortunate there with the hit reg, it seems as though Battlefield 3 can be hit or miss with the 10 hertz servers, it always has been a bit like that. And sometimes you do just have to fire a couple of extra shots. Now he's in a great position, the enemies are trying to get towards him and he has that advantage of having the shotgun in close quarters. Two clips from Scream. I always enjoy it when he sends clips in because this guy is incredible at Battlefield 3. He plays a whole lot of it and when he does manage to get a streak it's always worth watching. This one with the AN94, a super accurate streak on Metro. The second clip is once again on Metro and it's a big point stack with a bunch of kit switches. Epic stuff. Bruno Santos sent in three clips, he's the long range sniping player on Battlefield 3 that you've probably seen before, plays a lot of Caspian Border, look at this for a long range snipe on that moving target, takes out the driver of that buggy, absolutely insane stuff, and this clip he's going to be looking for a super long range snipe on Firestorm out of the side of this transport helicopter, he spots an enemy in the distance, manages to connect it at insane range 
You don't often see that on Battlefield 3. And finally, another long range snipe on an enemy attack helicopter once again on Caspian border. This episode of The Top Plays is sponsored by Instant Gaming. A big shout out to them for supporting this series and this channel. If you're looking for some cheap games, especially around this time of year, you'll find some fantastic deals on Instant Gaming. The link can be found in the description down below, whether it's for the PC, Xbox, PlayStation, or whether you're looking to buy a game for yourself or gift one to a friend. It's a fantastic website to find pretty much a deal on any game that you're looking for. Two clips from Lackey. Both of them are going to be on Nushout Canals with the Recon class. The first, he's looking to pick up some headshots using an ACOG scope and the M40A5. A really nice one, this. Showcasing that you don't have to have an automatic weapon in close quarters. The second one is a very satisfying sniping streak up on the top of the map here by the train he takes out a couple of players and then rotates around the left hand side as you often have to do on Nosha you have to work out where the enemies are spawning and if you're looking to keep your distance with a sniper just work out the best position to hold. He does exactly this with a load of kills. TC Bounties next with a few different clips. The first is going to be on Karg Island in this Amtrak. He's in the gunner seat. Bravo objective right in front of him. He's got to attack it. He's got to make sure that these enemy players are cleared off so they can completely control the objective, get it armed, and then destroy it, moving on to the next set of objectives. He gets a big point stack in the perfect position, really, to use this Amtrak. Not something that you see very often. Fuck them up. Oh, he's right here, right here, he's right here. Behind the building. Oh, he's right here. They're all, they're all. They're all. I'm shooting them <laughs> with everything I have. <laughs> oh, no. oh, my fucking god. Two, one. We got this. Nice. Oh, fucking nice, dude. Someone repaired me. That, that's, that was so crucial. Yeah, we got a repair guy. The next two clips from him are both on Metro, this one with the M16A3 and the Medic class getting so many kills, really struggling actually to get the reloads in on all the weapons using everything that he has just to clear out this part of the map. Push forward as much as you can, that's his philosophy, especially on Metro, and it works perfectly here. Behind TC the cheater? <laughs> Nice! Nice! I killed everybody. I knifed him. And the final clip he sent in is another one live on stream as he gets around the side here of the enemy players. They're completely clueless, wipes three of them out, drops a med bag down, waits for an enemy to push, luckily it's a friendly, and then he goes on a bit more of a streak. As you can tell, his team have this game won, they have all objectives, and the enemy team is struggling to get out of the base. That doesn't mean that there aren't kills to be had though, as he flanks around through the dead zone here and gets a really satisfying spray down. Oh, 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 oh. oh fucking shit, man. It's crazy. And I get him. I get him. Let's go, slug guy. Come on, come on. Oh my fucking god. Oh, what is this? <laughs> awesome. Boom, 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 boom. Get up. Let's keep pushing. 
Give me a weapon. I want to keep going. Just run. Brilliant. Brilliant. You saw him at the start of this episode with that epic 2800 point streak and now for two other clips it's Comric with two amazing collaterals on air vehicles. A handful of clips from Rama TV, the first is an Operation Metro clip using the 870 MCS, 10 kills in around 30 seconds, awesome stuff. Pretty epic. I'm just gonna be spawn beacon, dude. They said it? No, you bastard! I just like. Next up, it's a Sane crossing the fence as he looks to protect this part of the map. The LAV gets a bit of C4, takes that one out, which is great for his team. And then behind these unsuspecting enemy players, manages to put together a couple of shots, switches out to his secondary 44 Magnum and blasts them all away. Okay, this is good. Good play. I can't reload right now with my key. Nice. Very good. Sweet. I could reload my revolver right now, but I'm not going to. I'm just going to die here. That's fine. And finally, this one is a same crossing rush MCOM defense streak as he gets behind the enemy team once again, clears them all out, and gets that MCOM completely open for his team. Oh my goodness! It actually worked? Are you serious? No, I can't. I'm busy. I'm doing things. Thanks for watching this episode of the Battlefield Top Plays. If you did enjoy, feel free to leave a like down below. And if you've got any clips to send in yourself, the email is battlefieldtopplays at gmail.com. Thanks for watching, and I hope to catch you in the next episode.